Hey you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If this is the first time you guys are clicking on my videos, my name is Holly. I have a family of five, three children, myself and my husband. Um, I love sharing my grocery hauls. Um, so this week it's Monday and I went shopping today at Target. And I actually have uh, a pretty decent size uh, haul to show you guys. It was spent like $160. There is a few non-grocery items and I put those out too. So I'll show you guys that as well. Um, and yeah, let's get into it. Alright you guys, so let's get into it. And if I didn't already say, I'm sorry if I didn't, um, I went to Target today. So, And like I said, this is about $160 worth of stuff, which... You'll probably be surprised because I don't really think it's that much now that I'm looking at it. My cart was really full, but I don't know. I don't, it doesn't look like a lot to me. So I got some... I'll start over here. So I got some... These are wheat dinner rolls. Um, these were $2.79. I like these. They're actually from... Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. I was like, oh my god, is that mold? Um, these are fresh, like in the bakery at Target. And then I got some of this... Uh, what is this? The Pepperidge Farm, like, uh, homestyle oat bread. I've never tried this before, but I want to. I'm trying to, like, make sure, like, I eat at home more. Oh, and in my other video, uh, I'm in the middle of, like, uh, filming, like, a day in the life type video right now. And I talk about how for almost, it's been, like, a week and a half, I've been going to, um, I've been going to the gym, but I've been going to a class. And it's called Burn. It's an hour each time. So I've been trying to, like focus a little bit like on my eating too like because I've started working out so and then I got some of the taco shells um those are just the for the kids for tacos uh we have tacos every week that's definitely like a staple dinner around here um I got some bananas um some paper plates uh paper cups and then I got some of the Tide laundry detergent I wasn't out of laundry detergent but I like to keep an extra one, like, just in case, just because, yeah, just because. Um, and then I got some of the sandwich baggies. Um, the kids have been asking me to pack their lunch, so I'm going to do that this week. And I may share those um, in a video with you guys as well. They are very basic. They don't like anything too crazy when it comes to, like, packing their lunch. Um, but I can still show you guys if you guys want to see that. Um, and then I got some taco seasoning. I always buy just, like, a couple of these, like, every time I go to the store just to keep them on hand. Um, I got just some of the, I think this is just the Target brand, yeah, the Market Pantry. I got sour cream and onion, and then I also got some of the Sun Chips, the Harvest Cheddar. Um, I really like these. Actually, the kids don't really, um, they do, I guess, but they really prefer, like, the junkier type chips, like Doritos, stuff like that. Um, Cheetos, yeah. Anyways, so, and then I got some romaine lettuce, uh, just to chop up for salad. Um, I got some with shredded lettuce but we just call it taco lettuce it makes the tacos really good I think I don't know and it just yeah the kids call this taco lettuce so and then I got some of the two packs of the egg noodles I just like to keep these on hand because um oh yeah because I like to make uh, chicken and noodles and I'll share that recipe with you guys it's so super easy it's a huge hit in my house if you have kids it makes a lot um, especially, like I said, if you have a big family, it makes a ton. I will show you guys that recipe, um, in a video. I probably will make it sometime this week, so whenever I do that, I'll record that for you guys so you can see it. Um, I got two packs of the Totina roll, Totina roll, Totino's roll, pizza rolls. I got the combination and just the pepperoni. I got two of the chicken pot pies. Uh, Maya likes these and um, these like macaroni and cheeses. She likes to eat these after school. Um, she's picky, so like on the days that I don't pack her lunch, um, she's not good about telling me like ahead of time if she wants to have her lunch packed. Um, so sometimes I'm kind of just like, you know, I'm like, oh, you should have told me, like, I don't have, you know. Anyway, so she goes to school, then she comes home starving because, like I said, she's a very picky eater. Um, she also, I need to probably get more into this on my other, on my like in an actual like video where I'm talking to you guys but she actually is uh she has autism and she has like some weird texture issues not weird like as in like she's weird but just like she doesn't like certain textures of food and so yeah so that's comes into play a lot like with um 
you know, school lunches and stuff. She's just very, very picky. So um, I got some of the chicken pot pies and the macaroni and cheese. These are for her to make, like, whenever she gets home from school. Um, I just grab a couple of these every time, too, just in case, ever since last year. Um, you know, you just like to have a couple extra things, like, you know, stock up, like, slowly. I don't ever, like, buy a ton of stuff at once, like, as far as, like, just hoarding food but I like to get like a couple extra things each time that way you know you just have extras put up um I got two things of the chicken broth um I want to tell you guys that I've been seeing a lot of videos where people have been saying like basically if you want to start you really should start trying to plan ahead for your holiday shopping for things that like are shelf stable like the chicken broth um I think it's going to be kind of limited once it gets closer to the holidays. People are going to be, like I said, hoarding stuff. They buy it in big amounts. I just think it's going to be hard to come by. So if you guys need staples like this, I recommend just buying, like, you know, a few here and there every time you're at the store if you can, just so that you're not, like, at the last minute. And I, I just, I don't know how it's going to go for, like, the holidays, especially, like, you know, like I said, like Thanksgiving you may just want to like stock up, like I said, on some of the shelf-stable stuff that you know that you're going to use anyway. Um, I got a pack of the Capri Suns. Um, I got some orange juice. It's the Pulp Free. Yeah. Um, and then I got some Sprite Zero, 2% uh, milk. I got three cans of the cream of chicken. That's for my uh, chicken and noodles. Um, I got a, a thing of the red hot uh, wing sauce the franks um i'm gonna try to make air fryer chicken wings um and so i'll show you guys that as well um that's gonna be an experiment though i've never done it before so but like i said i'll take you along with me good or bad we'll show you just like we did the last one <laughs> um i got some cooking spray um maya asked for these specifically the danimal smoothies we did have some we just ran out i got these, uh, the Market Pandas, the Target brand, the strawberry and the apple cinnamon, they're just like the breakfast bars. Um, they really like these just for a snack on, on the way out in the morning. Like I said, most of the time they eat breakfast at school, but you know, kids, they just like to eat. So <laughs> they like to have those sometimes like on the way out the door. Um, some of the strawberry applesauce. I got this. It's um, the Better Oats. It's 100 calories per pack. I thought this would be good for me to eat after I get home from the gym. Like I said, keep on that, like, well, at least try to be, like, on the semi-clean eating just because I eat, like, a five-year-old normally. Um, I really should probably weigh, like, 400 pounds. So <laughs> I'm going to try to eat, like, a little bit cleaner, like I said, at least in my eyes, try to be better because I tend to really eat a lot of junk. Um, some smoked sausage. This is kind of like our meat for the week. I got smoked sausage. This is really for the kids. I don't eat this really. Um, some ground beef, um, some of the top sirloin steaks. If you guys don't shop at Target, you can get some really good deals on their meat because they put coupons on their meat sometimes. Um, so this package automatically was $5 off. They had a lot of different ones. I just picked one today, but you can get some really good deals at Target, like on their meat, and I think a lot of people don't really know that, so FYI. Um, I got a pack of the boneless, skinless chicken breast. I really wanted the organic, but girl, it's just getting expensive, so we just went with this one today. Um, I got some raisins. Maya likes those in her lunchbox. I was in the cereal aisle for like 20 minutes. I couldn't decide what cereal to get, so I just went ahead and got these. I've actually, I don't even know if I've ever bought these for the kids. My mom used to buy these, though, so I got these today because I could not decide. I just, I don't know. I got some of the baby goldfish. I don't know if I already said that. I got some Gatorade. I got an eight-pack of the blue, the Glacier Freeze, and then one red one, one orange one. Um, I got some of the Spider-Man uh, fruit snacks. We love Spider-Man, and the Spider-Man movie is going to come out soon, so that's exciting. Um, I got some Velveetas. You know, you guys know I like to have these in my coffee. I tell you that every single grocery haul. Um, not in my coffee. Oh my god. Not in my coffee. With my coffee. Um, I got these. This is just like a variety pack. Like, again, for the kids' lunchboxes, it's just really easy to throw those in there. Oops, sorry. I got blurry for a sec. Um, the Fudge Stripes, the Cheez-Its, and the Chips Deluxe. There's four of each in there. Um, I got the, these I think were like on sale for like $3.99 at Target. It's the mini Sunkist. I just thought, honestly, I really just thought they looked cool because they were like Halloween themed. I thought the kids would like those. Plus they just like them in general because who doesn't like soda? Um, and then I actually got uh, two packs of water. 
So, all right, you guys. So, here is my um, dinner plan for this week to go along with um, my grocery haul that I just shared with you guys. Um, so, today I'm going to be making um, uh, chicken and noodles. Um, and I'm actually doing a video right now, so I'm gonna, you guys are going to get to see that. So, if you guys want to try it, um, it's really, really good. My family really likes it. So, it's a, like I said, it's a hit for us. So, I'm going to do a video so you guys will be able to see that. And then um, Tuesday, I'm going to make tacos. Uh, Wednesday, I'm just going to keep it kind of simple and just do like popcorn chicken, mac and cheese, and some fruit. This is just like the frozen popcorn chicken that you can get um, the like in the freezer area. And then uh, Thursday, we're just going to have leftovers because we'll probably have leftovers from uh, at least, probably, we usually have leftovers from tacos and usually from this too. So Thursday we'll have leftovers. Friday we usually have pizza. Um, Saturday I'm going to try those, um, the chicken wings and the air fryer. And I don't really know what I'm going to make with it, so I just put that. And then um, Sunday I'm going to do um, steak and baked potatoes and salad. Um, yeah, and like I said, some of this, like, I don't know what I'm going to make with this. And uh, most of this stuff is like what my family is eating. Um, like I, I, if you watch my, um, like, evening cook with me that has uh, me making the chicken and noodles, I kind of went into it a little bit. So I've been uh, working out, and most of this stuff, like, I'm keeping it, like, very basic, though, just, like, uh, salad and meat and, you know, trying my best to, like, not eat bread and, like, sweets and stuff like that. So um, some of this stuff, like, I won't be, like, eating with them, but... Um, this is still like for my three kids and my husband so but yeah so that's for this week all right you guys so i really hope you enjoyed this grocery haul today and this meal plan for my family of five um i let me know in the comments are you guys still seeing like uh like food shortages like where you're at like uh empty shelves um definitely higher prices um like i said today i went to target and I spent, I think my total was like a hundred and, either a hundred and fifty or a hundred and sixty, but I have the Target red card, so I know I saved like five percent off of that, so, but, um, but yeah, prices are just getting like insane, so, um, but yeah, I appreciate you guys watching my video today. Like and subscribe and hit the bell if you guys want to know every single time I post. Um, I post weekly grocery hauls and random hauls that I uh, get in between. Um, I'm also doing a video, like I said, uh, when I was sharing my meal plan, that uh, I'm in the middle of like filming a video right now that I'm going to show you guys my chicken and noodles recipe. So uh, definitely, if that video is already up, I'll link it down below so you guys can see that. If not, definitely check it out whenever it drops. So but, uh, thanks, guys, again for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!